you're a VR vet or a total newbie, let me introduce you to your next headset, Oculus Quest 2. Quest 2 is our most advanced all-in-one VR system yet. Setup is easy, and in no time, you'll be immersed in an expansive library of amazing games and experiences. Operation is good. If you're new to VR, this is a great time and a great device to get started on. Welcome to the club. It's streamlined, light, and the new soft touch strap is easier than ever to slip on and off. There's six gigabytes of RAM and a new blazing fast Qualcomm Snapdragon XR2 platform. And all this power and speed is going to an almost 4K display. That's more pixels to experience the wonders of the world in all their breathtaking glory and make the stars of the curious tale of the stolen pets cuter and fluffier than anything digital ought to be. And since games get bigger as they get better, you can get Quest 2 with 256 gigabytes of storage built in. 3D positional audio adds another layer of realism, adapting as you move. And the controllers are our best yet. Updated with new ergonomics for an even more comfortable experience. And for the ultimate in immersion, some experiences even allow you to ditch the controllers and use your hands instead. So cool. As experiences go, the library is massive and growing every day. Some of my favorites are Beat Saber, Phantom Covert Ops, and Arizona Sunshine. All the Quest titles work on Quest 2, and gaming is just the beginning. There's literally something for everyone. Immersive 360 videos, live theater, 3D art pieces, concerts. And it's VR that's ready when you are. No PC or console needed. Once you set up with the Oculus smartphone app, you'll have everything you need to explore virtual worlds with just a headset and controllers. And no matter where you end up traveling, <laughs> Guardian helps keep you safe so that you don't bump into any furniture. Now I gotta get back to finding those pets. See you in VR. Thank you for watching. If you want to be notified to our next video, please subscribe and hit the bell button. Thanks again.